New at five, a company is proposing a new oil and gas drilling site in North McAllen. And as CBS 4's Imelda Mejia found out, the proposed site is smack in the middle of a neighborhood. Texacoma, an oil company out of Plano, Texas, is proposing a drilling site in North McAllen. Plans requested by CBS 4 News show that the well would start near Main Street and Frontera Road, and drilling would go horizontal under 10th Street, almost to Colonel Row. Plans also show a proposed new road from 10th Street to the site. The proposed site is surrounded by residential property. The drilling process is extremely disruptive. Um, there are diesel engines that operate 24-7, there are bright lights, um, it, there are emissions associated with this, bad smells, but also dangerous air pollution. In 2015, residents living north of Carnes City felt the impact of drilling gone bad when a well had to be shut down and residents within a three-mile radius had to be evacuated due to a natural gas leak. The Lower Rio Grande Valley Sierra Club is trying to notify residents living in the area because most don't know about the drilling plans. The city of McAllen is only required to notify people who live within 400 feet of the well. But the impacts of oil and gas drilling actually are much more widespread than that and can reach out to a quarter mile, a half mile. Many residents we spoke with didn't know anything about the plans. Only a few did through word of mouth. No, no so you de ese um, pensamiento. No me gustan, primero, porque está muy cerquita de la casa y, segundo, es un lugar que la verdad es un vecindario, es una subdivisión y yo no creo que es conveniente. Documents show that the drilling would end near Northgate Lane in Colonel Row. The proposed drilling line would be parallel to Orangewood North, a new subdivision described as an exclusive neighborhood. The broker and future residents of Orangewood North thinks the proposal for the drilling sites is a bad idea. Because there's a lot more at stake uh, than just an, uh, a natural gas well. If you look at the size of that project, the size of the other two projects, uh, Orangewood North and the estates in Orangewood North <clears throat> that are located to the east of Spanish Oaks, that's a total of $100 million of ad valorem tax uh, that the, the city of McAllen could see. A state law in 2015 signed by the governor limits local governments against fracking. But under the law, McAllen is grandfathered in, allowing them to deny the permit. In the city ordinance, it says that they can uh, reject any permit applications uh, that would lead to um, disadvantages, that would be disadvantageous to inhabitants. We reached out to Texacoma for a comment for this story, but after several phone calls, no one was available to speak with us or returned our calls. In McAllen, Imelda Mejia, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. And the McAllen City Council will re review the permit at their commission meeting on March 27th. Any concerned residents can attend that meeting and speak during public comments.